What's up Hoopers, it's Coach Alex from Think Pro Basketball and in today's video, we're gonna work on how to finish with some speed. Follow me and let's get it started. All right, so before we get started with the drill that we're gonna work on, to work on our change of speed, direction, and finishing quick, we're going to need you to click the link that's in the description so it'll send you straight to our website where all you have to do is enter your email address so we can send you a free workout today. Now, what we're gonna work on today, you have 15 seconds. So you're gonna need a phone, something to time you to really work on getting that timing down and counting how many you make. So the drill is you're gonna start at the free throw line. And what you're gonna do, you can use right hand layups, left hand layups, whatever you want. You gotta go, shoot the layup, make or miss, get your rebound, come back, touch the free throw line, and go. You got 15 seconds. How many can you make in 15 seconds? You're going to do three sets and try to beat your time each or you're gonna to try to beat how many reps you, or how many times you score each time that you go up. So you're setting a goal for yourself to try to beat. If you tie, that's okay. We don't want you to get worse. We want you to continue to improve on those numbers. So I'm gonna show you all three sets in full speed. Make sure you have somebody there to time you or put a clock where it's visible for you to see. So let's get started. Here we go, set number one. I'm gonna give myself an extra second for putting it down and then going. You can do the same. So here's set number one right here for you. Here we go, ready? Go. Fifteen seconds. That easy, that quick, you gotta really change your speed and direction. Set number two, I've gotta beat four this time. Ready? Set, go. Four again. Four, I got the same, I'm still trying to improve. Just don't go less, this time I'm gonna get five. Here we go, set number three, last set, trying to get five, go. Here we go, 15 seconds, finally got five. Now it's your turn. Now just a couple of things to think about and what this does for you. Number one, really makes you explode and really forces you to push through any fatigue, any time, you've got the time limit, so you're really trying to push through that and finish. You're trying to attack the basket hard and be quick. You're trying to change the speed and your direction once you hit that free throw line. We did this drill when I was in college where we had to go to the top we had 30 seconds, but we had to make eight. If we didn't make eight, we had to run. So it really forces you to push yourself hard, change your speed and direction quickly, and explode quickly to the basket and finish. Get that ball out. That's another one that you gotta think about. When you shoot a layup and you wait here, that's extra time taken off. When you shoot that layup, you go get it. Give yourself that extra second and a half, maybe half a second to really get another shot off. That could be a big difference maker. So. You've just seen the drill. You can see I'm tired and out of shape and out of breath, but it's important that you really just push yourself. Focus on these things when you're doing these drills. So until I see you next time, don't forget to get your free workout. Click the link. We'll send it to your email address. Once you get to our website, enter your email address. Don't forget to do that. And also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for me. Join the Think Pro family because every week we release brand new videos to help you work on all aspects of your game. Turn your notifications on. So every time we release a video, you'll be notified about it so you can keep up and keep getting better. So until I see you again, get out there, get some work in, a little bit of sweat, do different finishes, work on your left and right hand, give yourself more time if you want, but just push through it, really work on changing your speed, finishing quickly, get to the basket and knock it in. So until I see you again next time, Hoopers, remember to always keep hooping.